Okay, YouTube, welcome back to Fent Noobs Roll the Tanks of the Flying Fent. This is episode number 238. Uh, we have indeed gotten to a zoom with Lag Zuki. I'm waiting to see if he's going to invite uh, IS3 Tank 86. Um, and I'm going to be in. Eh, not bad. It's hard to type because I got I have my microphone between me and the keyboard, so I got to reach around my microphone. Um, what am I going to play though? Uh, Americanos, Fury. We done the Fury. We've done the T eighty. Oh, that's too bad. Oh, God. beer sounds like a good idea. Lags, okay, you are a genius, my friend. Um, so we've done... I'm going to do artillery again. I found out I need... Was it 31,000? To move past the bishop. So you get no sympathy from me, my friend, for needing 2,500. All right, there we go. There we go, governor. Uh, I can do this over here. Can I not? Create platoon. Yes, I can invite players. Invite everybody. Bam. Oh, okay. F four, three, two, one. Okay, well, Lagzuki's like in the platoon. Invite. Did that work? Did it go through? I hate that it doesn't tell you. I'm going to assume it did. All right, we're all set now. Fantastic. Um, I'm going to start with artillery. I don't even know if I spelled artillery right. I couldn't see. <laughs> All right. Are we all set? If you, if YouTubers out there didn't catch it, IS three tank eighty six said hi. <laughs> All right, there we go. I was just about to start singing a song about silence, but I couldn't remember the lyrics, so I didn't know. Ooh, KV-85 sneaks into the top tier. That or Maybe we got pulled into a higher tier battle because of it. Who knows? I don't think so, though. It's only a tier 5, isn't it? KV-85? If I'm not mistaken. Uh, so I have friendly artillery to help me out. There's another AMX. Or sorry, not another. There's an AMX 105 AM, and there's also an M44. So three artillery. It looks like uh, one, two, looks like we have two heavies. They have one, two, two heavies as well. Oh, they only have one heavy? Is it the t 14s a heavy though, isn't it? Or is that like a TI-4 or something? Or is this one of the cases where it's like a T-14 and a T-14 with no dash? I'm through, but whether it was a... Okay, here we go. Here we go. I'm going to... Oh, I thought there was more cover here, but there does not appear to be. Well, 
I don't know how useful cover would be anyway, so I might as well just nuzzle myself in over here. And, uh, see what we can do. Long range. You know, I like that the M4 here is semi-stationary. Oh, now he's moving. Of course now he's moving. Valentine dead. M4. You're moving too much, man. Oh, I'm gonna hit the wall. Oh, no, I didn't. Oh, just look at the amount of artillery that just rained down on that guy. That's ridiculous. This T-14's about to have the same type of treatment, I suspect. Nice. Nice. 205 damage right there. And IS tank took him out. Nice. Good work, team. Still had my aim. You know what? I'm just going to clutch it. Why not? Oh, it was close. It was very close. Uh, I'm actually going to reposition way back here on this Churchill gun carrier. I don't think he's moving. I don't even know which of those bullets was mine. Can't get to that. Oh, I can't get to that Matilda now. Oh, no, he just moved forward some more. I can maybe hit the Matilda. For those who aren't familiar, this is the exact platoon where I got my uh, ace tanker in this thing. Although I don't think I'm going to get an ace tanker this time. But you never know. There's not a lot of enemy tanks left to kill. Okay, that guy's down. This Grant's not going to be alive long enough for me to get a shot at, I don't think. I think that M4 is out of the way. Yep. And then uh, we have Artillier. Probably not going to be alive long enough, but we'll see. I think my shot hit him there too, but maybe not. And dead. One left, he's way in the corner. Um, my gun's not even going to reposition fast enough. Oh, and I can't reach. Double lose. I think I can reach now, but he's already dead. Yeah, I can reach now, but barely. Oh, good job, team. Good job. We kind of rolled over the other team. See, that's kind of sad, right? Times five and I got 1700 XP. Definitely not my finest hour. Like I said, I certainly wasn't about to get a uh, ace tanker badge on that one. But a win's a win, so we're up to 78%. I like seeing the purple. I like that this is up to 50 now with the bishop. That's a beautiful thing as well. Uh, all right, so now it would be the Churchill 3, I think, is what's up next. Oh, that's not how you spell Churchill. Uh, and then after Churchill 3, it's going to be the hmm, it'll be the T80. No, what's the what's my other German one? Am I missing a German tank? Oh, I am. I am. That's right. The uh, KV1. Uh No worries. Um, yeah. So I guess then it would be the B2. Um, next match, I'll show you my new tank. They'll be the first to see it. Because they don't, they, I haven't shown it in a video yet, right? I just picked it up. Uh, so, 
<laughs> that no one, no one knows that I have the Mighty Duck. I mean, you will by the time you watch this video, but as of right the moment that I'm recording this, nobody knows I have it but me. And I guess World of Tanks knows. They sold it to me, but... Um... Which way you want to go? City or valley? Time to roll out. Thanks for the push. Oh, don't go in the big hole. We'll never get out of it. <laughs> <laughs> Did you damage my tank? Oh, you did. Whatever. It's fine. So that guy's dead. I'm going to keep pushing up and around the back. Nobody here either. Where the heck is their enemy team? They must all be hiding out at their camp. Or going valley, but we've only spotted a handful of them on the valley side too. There we go. Now we're starting to see them. I am worried about uh, artillery, which is why I'm backing up here. Go ahead there, Lagzuk, if you want to get in on that. You can feel free. I'm going to head this way around the buildings. Where I have artillery cover. Oh wow, and just like that, pretty much the whole enemy team is dead. There's a handful of them still going, but we took out a bulk of their forces there. Uh, the bulk of the forces that were over here, I should say. I think the guys in the valley are doing a fair bit of work as well for us. Oh, come on, Hellcat, you're clogging up the line. Shit, get off the pot. Everyone's trying to get around you. All right, so Amy doesn't have a lot left in the tank at this point. I think I'm just going to sit here and take some long shots. It's KV-1 for now. Oh, 
Well, that didn't last very long. And all these guys are in the valley, so there's no reason to stay where I am. I better keep moving up. So look at that, I'm in a heavy tank, and I did 89 damage. That's kind of sad. But that's the beauty of World of Tanks, sometimes that's the way it goes. If your team's really pushing, and they're, you know, they're putting in a really good team effort, and if you get blocked by a Hellcat, that didn't help either, but, I mean, that would have been like, what, an extra 100 damage on that? I suppose it would have doubled my damage, but still, it's nothing ridiculous, right? What about now that Churchill's got to know his time's up? <laughs> He's swarming from all directions. There we go. Game over. We win. So I'm getting times five experience on garbage. Well, hopefully I did some spotting, but I don't think I did. I expect that's going to be menial, 2600 XP. Yeah, I didn't do very much there. I'm going to be way near the bottom. Holy smokes, it was highest in the team. What? No, it doesn't make sense. Oh, because I'm premium, I'm highest in the team, I bet. Because I did less damage than both of my compatriots. Uh, ready for the new tank? The Great Duck. <laughs> I'm sure they've seen the videos where I hum and haw about whether I should get it or not, so but there you go, I went for it. I got the Mighty Duck. Now, because I'm platooned, I might get pulled into something else, but normally this tank will only see Tier 4 battles. And it looks like we got pulled into something else because I'm platooned up. But yeah, the B2 by itself is a tier 4 to tier 4 matchup tank. It gets that very premium matchmaking, uh, which is very nice. But um, as soon as you platoon, right, you, you run the risk of getting sucked into something else. Even though I was platooned with tier 4s. Because that's the way it goes. Oh, look at this. SU5. He's going artillery. Go arty. I like it. Let's go. Yeah, they out heavy us, right? So we'll see how this goes. They're not some bad speed on this thing. For a heavy tank. It's not super quick, but it's not that slow either. I didn't realize it was such a big drop off here. Oh, there's a way across over here. Very good. Then I shall go this way. I knew there's a way across here. I didn't realize there was a big dip everywhere, except in the two little spots. All right. The Stug 3 has picked his spot.
I, I haven't literally haven't read a thing about this tank either. I have no idea what its strengths or weaknesses are. I literally just didn't care. It was basically like a free tank, as I said. No, neither do I. Alright, who shot me in the back? T-14, possibly? Possibly. SU-85B? Maybe. Not a fan of the turret, turret traverse. It's Wolverine out there. No, I don't- I can't see him. No visual contact on him. I mean, he's not even close either, right? So... Well, I think I've overstayed my welcome. Oh. Wow. Paper armor. <laughs> I had no idea. Wow. I... I thought the B2 was supposed to be a good tank. That was, uh, that was kind of sucky. I took that one, that one hit that took off, like, I don't know what... A, a fraction of my health, 30 health or something, and then one hit just wiped me out. To be fair, it's not supposed to see Type 5 battles, right? So there's that. But, uh, yeah. Interesting. Is there a shortcut for that attacking thing? Uh, chat mode. Let me go into settings and see. Under controls, where's the chat controls? Requesting fire, defend, affirmative, negative, help, reloading. No, so that must be like a... Macro of some sort. Lock hull. I've never done that. Lock hull. X. And that was just tank destroyers and SPGs, did it say? Oh, no, 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 no. Exit battle, no. Settings, there we go. Yeah, just SPGs and tank destroyers. Lock hull. Hmm. I wonder what that is. IS-3 knows he has a T-28 out there as well as an M8A1. Let's see if we can switch over to lag Zuki here. He looks to me like he is facing the Gula. Is it a gorilla or the SU-85? I don't know what it is that they had out there. Oh, now he's pointed at the M41. Do it. Nope, he's changed his mind again. Now he's just looking generally, generally, I mean, it's, oh, look at that guy popped his head out and rounds were on the, right, on the way already. Ooh, we just saw stuff exploding there. There's people are interested in killing IS-3 tank here. Oh, excuse me. I am tired. Looks like he missed the T-28. There we go, Lagsy helping out. And the Gorilla helping out. Good arty support. And that's for the whole team here. Because that was both the Gorilla and uh, Lagsy helping out there. This 
splash damage. It's a wonderful thing. Oh, you're in trouble now. You got a repair kit? Oh, it looks like you did have a repair kit. Oof. You're in a rather uh, precarious position, eh? So what do we have? We have two artillery, a tank destroyer. Our friend IS-3 here in the Che He. Or Chi He, or however the heck it's pronounced. And a uh, Crusader. Alright, two artillery, the Stug, the Che He, and a Crusader. So a light, a medium, and all they have is four tank destroyers. Of course, the IS-3 tank was doing, I think, the bulk of the spotting out there, but he can't really anymore because he's one hit away from death. Let's see what our scout tank is doing here. Oh, he's in rough shape too. He's in even worse shape than IS-3 tank is. All right, Stug, you gonna end that SU-85B? You did, good work. I hope you're moving now. Oh, it doesn't matter, they have no artillery left. Nice. This is gonna be a long battle. There's the head, sir. Oh. Oh. This is horrible. The stress of it all. Woof. Guy's going for danger close. He doesn't even care. Ah, oh, nice. I was close. I might not have a shot through that little window. It's quite possible. And of course, with a 21 second reload, he might not get it. Oh. <laughs> nice, good kill. Now here comes another one. Nice. One left. Good work, team. Good work, team. You can see Lagzuk, he's pushing up because he lacks the range. I think the Crusader's going to move up. Uh, maybe he's not going to move up. He has to, though, right? Have four minutes. Oh, but spotted.
This guy shouldn't move forward in cap. Minute and a half. Good. So that guy has to come out. If he doesn't want to lose. Look at this legs look he's gonna scout. <laughs> he's taking a book from my page, scouting and artillery. There he is. Miss. All right, GG everybody. GG, well done. Well played, good scouting. That Gruda had a good game with some times five XP, oof. He is going to be a happy man. Oh, yeah, that's so sad. So sad. Look at that. Worst in the team. By a mile. Hey, look at that. 535. So that's 2,500 XP in, a, in artillery. Not bad, eh? Not bad at all. And then the Crusader there that did all the scouting. He, uh, he did quite well for himself as well. All right. Uh, oh, this thing I obviously haven't... Uh, oh, look at this. I didn't do anything with this thing. Uh, first aid kit. Repair kit, fire extinguisher. There we go. All right, next. Because that was a win, right? It's hard to keep track of this stuff. I think uh, T14, right? Yeah. I can do one more. Tier 5 heavy, what do you think? <laughs> oh, Crusade, look at that, we got a heavy and a scout. <coughs> uh, the crew isn't ready. They're in the church 3. A stug. Interesting. Interesting choice. So we got a heavy, a scout, and a tank destroyer. Oh, but we're bottom tier. Shoot. Shoot, shoot, shoot. All right. There is M44, so there's uh, one artillery. Two Two artillery on the other team, but the other one's a birdie. What do we have? We have a Hummel and an M44. So I think we have better artillery than them. Um, I have a KV2, a KV85. Is he one for the Fury? Yeah. Yeah. We'll see. We'll see how this goes. We will see how it goes. Oh, apparently the battle started and I didn't even know about it. All right, so our artillery is doing some fine work to the guys up on the hill there that have been spotted. I guess not just our artillery.
Speaking of artillery, I'm gonna have to worry about artillery in a moment here. I have good sight lines on me. Oh, people really do not like artillery. If it's worth being quite that angry about, but Drive on. Looks like that track got fixed just in time. Oh one hit kill? Seriously? Or was it, no, I'm sorry, that wasn't one hit. Wow. Wow. Well, we're game over. We lose. Right there. <laughs> Look at that. I got 45 XP. Uh... Oh, I was going to say see you later, but he's already gone. All right. Well, I'm going to end it here for myself as well. Uh, we took a good chunk. We did a good bit of, uh, of plan, got a bunch of experience done. Um, I do have a few more to do. I might do a third episode just because of the times five event. We'll see. We'll see. I'm still not sure how these are going to go out. My throat's still a little kind of iffy. So, uh, so we'll see how many I record today and how many go out. Uh, although I do. Oh, we won. Look at that. We won in the B2 in the end. <laughs> oh, I never did check the accelerate. Training. There we go. Um, uh, yeah, I was just saying, uh, at some point I'm going to stop recording these and start uploading them. I've got a bunch recorded that I haven't uploaded yet. I'm going to upload them uh, tonight as soon as I finish recording. Uh, but if you enjoyed this episode, please leave a like. It really does help me out. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. For now, though, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.